You know what this means. Hey, girly pops. Welcome back to Fam Friday. If you haven't gotten your lavender. Okay, Spock is completely blocking it. Spock, you have to tell them how cute they would look in it. Look, it's embroidered. It's so cute. And we did a restock because I felt nice this time. Usually I don't restock because I'm like, ha ha, you didn't get it. But this time I was like, you know what? Fam Friday hoodies are a staple so that we can all wear them on Fam Friday. Okay, so you guys know me. I'm not one to spend money here and there. I'm one to save all my money and then spend it all at one time for like the entire quarter of the year. So basically every quarter I do one of these really big hauls that seem really excessive, but you gotta realize that I'm not spending money really any other time than this. So welcome to this video so I can make it all a tax write off. Day six, no Starbucks for me, and my body fat percentage has already dropped 3%. Is that not insane in six days? And this haul was inspired by, um, I'm sure it's already in the thumbnail and you probably already know what it is, but I've been wanting something from Apple for a very long time, but we're gonna get to that later. We're gonna start off with the clothing because everyone loves a good Urban Outfitters haul. It's just so basic and um, let's just all admit that we like it for a reason, okay? I've been on the quest to be more feminine and girly for a very long time, which, you know, is just something that I feel is right in my heart, something I wanna do. So I wanna wear a lot of dresses this summer and out of all the ones that I chose to put on, in the dressing room, this is the only one that I liked, but it is so pretty it looks so ethereal and epic and awesome and it is a good color with my hair I feel like this tone with dark hair looks good yeah I just feel like a nice little butterfly it doesn't look too innocent but not too fit you know it's just a it's a great Haley fam dress for me I don't know why I just said my name like that I really didn't enjoy that I'm just kind of annoying myself right now okay I'm gonna stop doing that <clears throat> I got this shirt. I feel like I really do gravitate towards black tops because they match my hair And this is one of the only ones that actually fits me because it's actually elastic right here and I don't even have okay We're not even gonna talk about boobs, but like they're annoying when it comes to summer tops. Let's just say that okay Oh, I got a skirt. This is so unusual for me a nice elastic skirt and it's got a nice little slit in the leg and uh, I don't know I thought I could like wear like t-shirt fit. I don't know <laughs> if there's one thing I'm really bad at it's um, summer outfits I I don't know what to do with my body in the summertime like I don't know <sighs> for example today I wore a crop top and shorts like any regular teenage girl would during the summertime when it's 100 degrees and what did I do I put a flannel on top of it because I just felt so exposed and the modesty within me just doesn't allow me for summer wardrobe so it's a uh, very confusing for me to figure out a summer wardrobe and summer outfits that are actually cute but I'm trying I'm learning and hopefully we can learn together and I try to look at Pinterest and I don't know why I'm telling you this. Okay, moving along. I got two pairs of shorts that are very patriotic looking. I got these ones because they look fun. High-waisted, not much to say about those. And these ones are so cute. I'm definitely gonna have a 4th of July outfit this year because I never have one. It always makes me so sad. So, I got these shorts. Probably gonna wear it with something cool. I don't know. I feel like if your shorts are cool, then you can just kind of relax with the top. You can just wear like a white t-shirt. And just because your shorts are cool, your outfit is cool. So that's my motto when I don't know how to make outfits. Hello, Spock. All right, next, Lululemon. I was really treating myself, really treating myself today. I don't have any workout shorts that fit me anymore because either they shrunk in the wash or like I gained weight. I don't really know. So I just got some new ones. Lululemon shorts are scarily short. Like even even if I size up, they're still just so short. Like the waist gets wider, but the shorts don't get longer in length. So these are all very, very short shorts, but it's fine. Just going to the gym, probably gonna wear a baggy t-shirt over it anyway. So I got just that staple pair of black shorts and then material of these are just so nice. So just for summer in general, going hiking, going paddle boarding, you know, stuff that I always tell myself I'm gonna do during the summer and then never actually do, but in theory, it sounds really nice. And hopefully this year I actually do that stuff and I also got this pair and periwinkle and I also bought two items from Lululemon from my friend she was doing a like, fundraising thing for volleyball and I got a pair like this but in orange and like a navy green sports bra so can't wait for that yay hello girly box okay next forever 21 I only got one thing from here they were looking real <sighs> what's the word oh <laughs> What is the word for what Forever 21 looked like when I went in there? 
just cheap. They were looking a little cheap, so I only found one thing that I liked. They were also doing like a lot of partnerships with different brands. Like they had a partnership with Pepsi, Coke, Flame and Hot Cheetos, and Ford, the car company. It's this cropped hoodie type thing, and then it just says USA. Very festive, patriotic in the US shops. During this time, it's almost 4th of July, and I feel like I look like such a cool girl. Like, I feel like a really attractive lifeguard would wear something like this, you know? So hopefully I look like that when I wear it. Hello, Spock. Hello, girly Spocks. Welcome back to my channel. I take over for Haley because she is stupid, and I am so much cuter than Haley. Now on my channel, we are going to be trying designer clothes later, but don't tell anyone it's a spoiler. I needed Birkenstocks because apartment living, there's a lot of walking. I walk down flights of stairs to take Spock out like five times a day. I go to Ryan's place. Just I just needed a pair of Birkenstocks, and the ones I previously had were three years old. I had taken them to Vietnam. They'd gotten wet all the time. And finally, Addie's dog, Ollie, just chewed right through them. So finally got an excuse to buy new Birkenstocks. I wanted the pair that you put your toe through, if you know what I'm saying. But I just got the basic ones, and these also make you look like you're a cool summer girl, so. I don't know what that means. There's nothing to be growling at, Spokaroonie. And what we all came here for. It's not every day that you get a bag like this. No, no, no. Okay, so I've really been wanting an Apple Watch for a really long time, and recently I've been on this new health journey. I'm quitting Starbucks day six, by the way, if you didn't know. So I've been really into health and fitness. I've been on that workout grind. I'm doing an eight week program. Um, I'm just really getting into that health journey and what better to motivate you than an Apple Watch. And also all of the like aesthetic pictures of Apple Watches on Pinterest also didn't help my want for one so badly. So I got this thing. This is the series four. I got the silver aluminum case with the white sport band. They've got this fuchsia band that is so cute, but you have to buy them separately. And I was like, oh my gosh, I just bought an Apple Watch. I'm not buying that. So let's, ooh, that's satisfying. Let's unbox the Apple Watch. I have no idea how to use it, but it's gonna be so fun because you can like compete against your friends in fitness activities. So I always go to the gym with Ryan and we can like compete and stuff. We play basketball every day and I wanna like track how long we do it. I wanna track my steps. I don't really, okay, you know, I did not get the one that has LTE. You have to pay $10 a month for that. So it's basically like buying an entirely new phone, which is just I'm not that level of insane Oh my gosh, it's so cute Look when you're buying an Apple watch You're really just spending the money on the name and the aesthetic because I could totally have gotten a Fitbit But you know that would be practical and that's not what I do. Just kidding I'm a practical gal when it comes to certain things just not aesthetic things <laughs> Look how cute that packaging is. Okay, so this is the watch. This is the strap. I guess I really don't know how to use this at all Let's open it Wow, it's this whole long thing and it's just right there. All right, so um, hope you've got your charger and everything. Okay, okay. I feel like I'm about to lose everything. I'm really nervous. Okay, what do I do? Let me open this. Can't wait to go play basketball today wearing this. Oh, wow. Cool. So we got our strappy waps right here. So satisfying. It's like a little iPod touch. Ooh, the face. I just got really nervous about dropping it and then I remembered I got Apple care, so that's good. Um, why do I do this? Ah, it's turning on. Dude, I don't know what I'm doing. I get Ryan over here. He has an Apple watch. He knows how to do this. I'm nervous. Oh, wow. That is so epic. Slide those. Oh my gosh. Low battery. Come on, my dude. Just got it. Okay. Let me put it on. Girl, I told him I did not need the extra long one, and he gave it to me anyway, and he upcharged me. He's a sneaky guy. Sneaky, sneaky. See, okay, there's a small and a large, and the larger one is a little bit more money. And this is the large one. I did not ask for that, and I'm on the last. Boy, he tricked me. I'm upset. Oh, I'm looking fresh to death. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm like a girl who just got engaged or something. Look at that thing. It's so cute. I'm gonna like play basketball and like track my steps, be like boop boop papa. Got a work message. Who is it? Boop boop beep boop boop papa. Hello, palakata. I don't know how to use this yet, but I'm so excited to learn. I know like the features obviously or else I wouldn't have bought it, but I'm really excited to 
mess around with it. I'm gonna be messing around with it more on my vlog channel, getting that aesthetic that I see on Pinterest, probably taking a picture of it and all that stuff, tracking my steps, showing you guys. And you can show like how many calories you burn and be like, guys, I worked out for this long. Like follow my work health journey. So excited. <laughs> okay, that's enough. I'm getting into my little weird mode because I'm a little too excited. So I'm gonna end the video there. Oh my gosh, look what I just saw when I looked down at my Apple Watch. Cute little embroidered star right there. If you haven't gotten your Fam Friday hoodie, make sure to go get them while they're still in stock and we can all wear them collectively as a family on Fam Friday. If you're new here, subscribe to join the family because my last name is Fam and then Illy means I love you. It's so cheesy and gross and that's my entire channel here, so. Welcome to that. And turn on the post notifications, which is the bell by the subscription button because then you'll actually get a little notification on your phone every time I post a video because subscriptions don't do that anymore. I also have a vlog channel where I post a lot of extra stuff about my life. I have an Instagram where I post every day. I have a Twitter where I post every day. I have demerches and my dog Spock has an Instagram and I'm all over the internet if you would like to look. So that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will see you guys next time. Somewhere else on the internet. God bless girly pops. Bye. Sorry, I just had to do that one last time. Okay. this freaking thumbnail. I don't freaking know. <sighs> Time to charge my Apple Watch.